where the World Expo was in New York. Uh, there was a building they ran there for a while, and that would and that would be just God. It was it was brutal how fucking just packed and hot that was. So when I think of that hotel, I think of our and the kayfabe commentaries days the the cursed Buff Bagwell shoot where uh, <clears throat> he was carried into the lobby. I recount this in the opening was he, chapter uh, of my book. Was that before or after he was uh, vaccinated? You know, <clears throat> mm. uh, from the condition, I might say, afterwards. <laughs> um, but, uh, yeah, that was uh, that was at that location. You know, he, on, um, on one of his socials, he posted, he tagged me or referenced me, and he's like, this is somebody that I have to apologize to. I guess he's clean, or was at the time of the text. And uh, I've heard that he's, I heard that the, the situation he had was was uh, was what he said. He had been clean, and it was something that he was. Uh, oh, right, when we heard that there was yeah, a relapse. Yeah, that, yeah. Yeah, it was something he was <clears throat> dealing with that was, that was prior, that he's. But he did. Uh, he did tweet that he uh, that I'm someone he owed an apology. Then I read that his his Twitter was hacked. So I, I don't know if it, if it was him. I'm I'm willing to hear his apology. I I don't hold a grudge. Jesus, it gave me a great introduction to that book. People still talk about it to this day. The carrying of Buff in, and then the carrying of Buff out. Um. So uh, all right, Tommy Damon also wanted to get in this week. Said normally I catch this show about an hour after it starts and just watch it. Uh, from the start to know that's not being in the moment, but I can't help it. I love the intro from the child saying that this podcast has adult discussion and foul language, or however she says it, it really sets the mood. And, of course, the intro song, which always reminds me of Goodfellas, around the time when they've done the heist and the loose ends are being dealt with anyway. There's T's beautiful masterpiece, Sophia, at the end. And, of course, Nash and Ollie, magic that happens in between. Very succinctly put, oh, Tommy. That was, that was kind. That's a journey through the whole show. And finally, uh, I did want to acknowledge Whiplash Dynamo for the strangest uh, comment this week. Nash should be in the next Predator movie like Jesse Ventura was, a sexual Tyrannosaurus. Maybe that's another shirt. But you can, uh, if you ever get tired of Big Sexy... You can be the sexual so, Tyrannosaurus. Or I could end up with Sid Caesar. I mean, what? out of respect. Right, right. <clears throat> I just pictured, like, the little Tyrannosaurus arms. Right. You know, going a full 60 minutes on the... You couldn't get to it. Hammering off. Right, exactly. You'd, you'd have to lean in, in such a fashion that would uh, 